Every now and then, we scout out technologies with the potential to make a significant difference globally. Here's a rundown of the latest advancements we believe are truly game changers at the moment. Super efficient solar cells. Solar power is spreading fast worldwide, playing a crucial role in cutting down carbon emissions on a global scale. Yet, despite its growth, current solar panels aren't fully efficient in converting sunlight into electricity. There's a promising solution, integrating tiny crystals known as perovskites alongside traditional silicon. This combo could skyrocket the efficiency of solar panels to unprecedented levels. Over the past decade, scientists have been refining perovskite solar tech, consistently outdoing previous efficiency achievements. Traditional silicon cells, dominating 95% of the solar market, have limitations, topping out at around 30% efficiency. In contrast, perovskite-only cells have hit experimental efficiencies of roughly 26%. However, when paired with silicon in tandem cells, perovskites can harness a broader range of sunlight wavelengths, enhancing electricity production. Perovskite tandem cells have already surpassed 33% efficiency in lab settings. The potential is huge. If deployed widely, they could outperform legacy solar cells, generating more electricity at a lower cost. Exascale Computers In May 2022, the global supercomputing landscape saw a seismic shift with the debut of Frontier. Now crowned as the world's fastest supercomputer, it boasts a mind-boggling capability to execute over one quintillion floating-point operations per second, represented by a 1, followed by 18 zeros, also known as an exaflop. To put it in perspective, Frontier can crunch numbers in a single-second equivalent to what 100,000 laptops combined can achieve. Frontier's launch, housed at Oak Ridge National Laboratory in Tennessee, marks the official commencement of the exascale computing era. Several more exascale supercomputers are set to follow suit. In the US, researchers are gearing up for the installation of two machines that will surpass Frontier's speed. El Capitan, slated for Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory in California, and Aurora, to be housed at Argonne National Laboratory in Illinois. Europe is also poised to unveil its inaugural exascale supercomputer, Jupiter, anticipated to go live by late 2024. While China reportedly has exascale computing capabilities, it hasn't disclosed results from standard benchmark tests. Scientists and engineers are eager to leverage these powerhouse computers to propel various fields forward. For instance, Astrophysicists are already harnessing Frontier's immense computational prowess to model the intricate flow of gas within and around the Milky Way. Beyond simulating large-scale galactic motions, their model delves into the dynamics of supernova explosions, underscoring supercomputers' unparalleled capacity to simulate diverse physical phenomena across multiple scales simultaneously. Generative AI it's no surprise that generative AI is set to make a big impact across industries in 2024. Beyond its expected role in customer service, businesses are leveraging generative AI to translate natural language into code and autonomously manage that code across different platforms. According to a recent Deloitte report, excitement about generative AI is high among business and tech leaders, with 62% expressing enthusiasm. A whopping 79% anticipate significant transformation in their organizations and industries within the next three years, with 31% expecting changes within just one year. Besides streamlining tasks and boosting productivity through smart automation, generative AI is also tackling specialized challenges. In agriculture, for instance, Startups are using AI to detect crop-damaging pests and suggest automated solutions to aid rural farming communities. In fields like construction and heavy machinery, this tech is employed to simulate real-world scenarios for workforce training, minimizing risks. Likewise, autonomous vehicle developers are using it to create accident simulations to safely train self-driving features. Generative AI isn't going anywhere, 
and it's being adopted across the market in various capacities. From basic chatbot support to overhauling supply chains, its impact is felt across the board. Heat pumps. Don't be misled by the name. Heat pumps do more than just generate warmth. They're appliances that use electricity to both cool and heat spaces. Despite many buildings still relying on fossil fuels like natural gas for heating, there's a push toward electric heat pumps fueled by renewable energy sources. This shift could significantly slash emissions from homes, offices, and even manufacturing plants. While heat pumps have been around since the mid-20th century, the technology is experiencing a resurgence. Global sales surged by 11% in 2022, marking the second consecutive year of double-digit growth, although the pace may have tapered off in 2023. Europe witnessed a remarkable transformation, with a 40% increase in heat pump installations by 2022, largely driven by the energy crisis sparked by the Russia-Ukraine conflict and efforts to reduce reliance on natural gas. Extended Reality VR, AR, XR. As processing power continues to advance, 2024 promises to be a groundbreaking year for extended reality applications and devices. Notably, products like Apple's Vision Pro have already generated considerable interest in the AR VR realm. In manufacturing, AR smart glasses, such as those offered by Vuzix, are revolutionizing production processes by accelerating workflows, ensuring compliance with protocols, and cutting down training times through hands-free instructional support for workers. The influence of AR extends into sports, where Vuzix Labs Smart Swim, a wearable AR device for swimmers, fits seamlessly into swim goggles, providing real-time workout status and performance metrics to enhance athletes' performance without interrupting their training. Gene Editing Treatment A groundbreaking gene editing cure has finally arrived leaving patients full of gratitude and calling it life-changing. Just 11 years ago, scientists introduced the powerful DNA editing tool known as CRISPR. Now, they've taken CRISPR from the lab to the realm of real medicine, offering a treatment that effectively cures the symptoms of sickle cell disease. Sickle cell disease stems from inheriting two faulty copies of a gene responsible for producing hemoglobin. Its symptoms include excruciating pain episodes, and the average life expectancy with the disease is only 53 years. In the U.S., it affects approximately one in every 4,000 people, with the vast majority being African American. So, why did sickle cell become CRISPR's first success story? A fortunate biological quirk holds part of the answer. Our bodies possess an alternative method of producing hemoglobin that deactivates after birth. Researchers discovered that a simple edit to bone marrow cells could reactivate this process. Enhanced geothermal systems, geothermal heat, an abundant and clean energy source offers a steady alternative to fossil fuels regardless of weather conditions or time of day. Traditional geothermal plants rely on specific geological features like permeable rocks with water sources, limiting their widespread use. Despite its potential, geothermal energy contributes less than 1% to global renewable energy capacity. But there's hope on the horizon with enhanced geothermal systems, a technology that's been in development since the 1970s and is now showing promising advancements. Recent breakthroughs indicate that enhanced geothermal systems could significantly boost renewable energy production. Fervo Energy successfully tested one such system in Nevada last year, demonstrating its commercial feasibility. They're now working on another project in Utah, aiming to deliver consistent, clean power by 2026. Weight loss drugs. About a third of adults in the US are dealing with obesity, a health issue that heightens their risk of heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. Anti-obesity drugs like Wegovy and Monjaro are being hailed as potential solutions to this growing public health concern you've probably stumbled upon success stories all over the internet. Novo Nordisk, the company behind these medications, has seen their profits soar, and pharmacies are having trouble keeping these drugs on their shelves. These drugs work by curbing appetite, originally designed to manage type 2 diabetes. Make sure to hit that subscribe button to keep up with all the latest updates. 
Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next video.